Okay, guys, here is our little Salvation Army thrift store. It's very small. Uh, if you all have watched me at all, y'all know that I have said, hello, that uh, this particular thrift store is kind of in a creepy part of town. Well, this is it. It's pushed way back into a parking lot. Uh, it's just kind of creepy, but we're going to go in. Hopefully they don't say anything to me about videotaping. Uh, this store has cleaned up quite a bit since the last time we were here. Uh, so we're going to sneak a peek. Okay. Yes, they are. Oh. Yeah. Okay. There's a foot. You can sit in it. The bag is too small. You could climb in and sit in it. Nope. Careful. Oh my. Okay, we'll see how this works. Oh, aren't those pretty? I'm looking at all of them, Peanut. My size, too. $4.99. They're so tiny. Oh, we're creaking. How cute for a little foot. Mm. Say hello. Say hi, YouTube. <laughs> He's not happy about being here. He wanted to go to Target first. But we'll get to Target. This is kind of cool in a weird way. Basket creeks, basket buggy, depending on where you're from. Some of y'all might call it a basket, some of y'all might call it a buggy. This is so cute. Can we do it like the same time like we did last time? Hmm? Can we do what, babe? Can we do the same thing like last time? Oh, what's the color tag this week? This is really cute. What did we do last time, babe? Yes, we'll look all around. We'll look all around. What's the deal? Huh. Here's my favorite section of any thrift store. The housey stuff. Oh, that's nice for Christmas. They're $1.99. That would make a pretty wreath. Put ribbons and stuff on it. It's pretty. My weakness. You guys know I love a coffee mug. 
flowers for $6.99. Look how pretty that is. Is this an oil burner? It looks like there's a wick in there and like you could burn oils in it. It's kind of interesting. I thought it was a bud vase. How cute is this shot glass? Authentic Cajun, honorary Cajun, good old boy, Demyanks. So cute. That is so pretty. Could put nuts in it and a nutcracker. It's not that pretty. Ain't that cute? Look. Look at there. And look here. So cute. Y'all know I like crosses. That would look good in my living room because of the blue. That's pretty, babe. Is it a cross? Is it a flower, though? I'm not sure. No. What, Peanut? The yeah. little house? Yeah. You love the houses, don't you? Yeah. You want to look at it? Yeah. Be careful with it. That looks pretty. You like those? Yeah, I like those. Told you guys he loves little houses. Oh, goodness gracious. Look at the kitty cats. Oh, look. Oh, is the glass in it? Oh, the glass is not in it. It is so pretty, though. missing too. That's so pretty. Imagine. That is really pretty. But where would I find glass tiles to fix that? Oh my gosh. How cute is that? It's a vase. I'm getting this for one of my co-workers. She is emoji obsessed. I like this. I think that'll be cute on her desk. I like this. You like that? Yeah. We may have to get it, huh? Yeah. I thought this was funny. They have a squatty potty for $5.99. I saw these at Target, not for $5.99. Look, Donna, if you're watching, every time I see Christmas, I think of you. This is adorable. So cute. Thriftastic mom. Looky, looky. It has a sticker. I wonder how old these peppercorns are. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at these. They are so pretty. They're $4.99 a set. So pretty. Many books, but we always stop and look because you never know. 
I've cleared out a lot of Caleb's baby books, so we're moving on to a little older titles. So we love to look at the books. Pulling into my thrift town, which used to be way more packed, but now that word has gotten out that they're leaving, I think people are um, kind of bumming out. But little man is ready to get his thrift on, and then we're going where after? Where Target. We... And where else? Weiss Park. Weiss Park, yep. Yeah. So let's go in here and close your mouth. He's eating Starburst after lunch. Let's see what's going on. Okay, I got it. Okay, I just want one more and put the put the thing in the purse. Okay. And then we get our thrift on. Okay. Okay. We're working with blue and pink today. Oh my sweet boy. Let's go check out the winter clothes for you. I don't know why I say winter clothes when I want to look at all clothes. Sorry if I'm making you guys dizzy. Let's see. Probably find your summer stuff way cheaper right now. This kind of stuff is good for karate. And that's even better. So, yep. I'll snoop around and keep y'all in the snoop loop. Y'all know I'm a sucker for a sweater. Hello. I like it. It's his size. And you know I got a coupon somewhere. What y'all think? What, sweetie? <laughs> He's an angry Eminem. <laughs> Silly. Hmm. I don't know, guys. I'm tempted. Okay, he's ready. What are you doing? You microwaved him? Oh my goodness gracious. My child has just gone a little nuts. He doesn't need any more jeans either, but darn it. These are nice looking little jeans. I don't know what I'm going to do without this place. I just hope they don't move it so far away. <gasps> I see a Snoopy. Can I see you? Can I oh, see you? I have, Can I see you? I have a little MetLife Snoopy. Are you going to microwave them too, you yeah. weirdo? That's horrible. Uh, Let's see what else they got here. Any Mickeys? Do you see any Mickey Mouse? An emoji. An emoji? Oh goodness, leave it to your eagle eyes. He loves thirsting guys. Are you going to microwave them too? My goodness. Sock monkeys. Plenty of sock monkeys. What's a sock monkey? This little sock monkey. We see those at Target all the time. Target? Yeah, the little sock monkeys. What? Yeah. This is our treasure trove. This is where why he likes to come. He likes to go through all the little bags. And you never know. Sometimes you find awesome things in here. Uh 
Oh, cool. Never seen a wood file cabinet. Excuse me, Peanut. Excuse me. The random junk shelves that I have found awesome things in. Beep beep. Excuse me, babe. Oh yeah, I can play with this right here. I need my person. I like these trunks. This is what I made my jewelry box out of. It's cool if you're gonna get it, make sure you don't leave it behind. Oh, I get it. Let's see if we find any random goodness in here. This go around. Mm, no, it doesn't look like. Roller blades. I never got a hang of this. Never. Randomness, randomness, randomness. Back here every now and then you come across good furniture, sometimes not. Headboards, shelves. Little dude doesn't like being back here. He thinks it's creepy. Oh goodness. Oh, it's a penguin. A little light up penguin. A lot of electronics. I don't mess around with the electronics. I've never bought anything bad. If that works, that's a pretty awesome price for just a monitor. What is this thing? What is it? It's metal. I'm not sure what it is, but I like it. Oh, it must be missing a flower up here. Well, this metal objet d'art is $12.99. I don't like it that much. Oh, goodness. Do you light up? see you don't see that price they are tripping too bad I won't let little dude see it because he'll want it look at this 1970s monstrosity that really should have gone in the trash heap how do you close this you snap it there you go let's see what else Ooh, oh, spookiness let's see what else let's see what else lots of wired accoutrement Ooh, my Christmas ladies. See, if you guys had patience, y'all could fluff this up. I don't have that patience. Lots of flora. Creeping up on the Christmas. Miss Donna, there's another buddy to that 70s monstrosity. Spooky. I bet it was cute at one time. Sit on the sofa. I'm headed your way. Here's this seasonal stuff. Oh. That kitty does not look happy. Merry Christmas, really? He looks all depressed. Oh, how cute is this? Oh, so cute. It's missing an acorn. See? So cute. It's a little slap together, this go around. <laughs> Let's see. Hi, sweetie. Are we buying that? Okay, it's going in the basket. I guess so. Hmm? You don't want it? Okay, we'll put it back in a bit. Okay. 
Ooh, pretty. So pretty. It's cute. Aww. You'll know me in a picture frame. And I have the perfect picture to put in there. So cute. That's cute. And that price isn't. Let it snow. I have some really cute pictures of the boys. The few times we had snow here in Dallas that I think would be cute in there. Oh, what is this? What is this? I love Snoopy. Oh, VHS. My VCR has died. Okay, y'all know I gotta come here. Y'all knew I gotta come in here. That's a good one. Shoes, shoes, shoes. I've been so good at not buying shoes. Because ever since the whole broken toe incident, I can't wear heels as comfortably as I used to. Plus, I've gotten to where I wear scrubs so much that um, basic flats are just tennis shoes or basic flats are the best thing usually he's still debating over this thing I can tell does he want it does he not want it oh I've been wanting a little white purse you don't want it okay we won't take it that is so cute Again, it's not $7.99 worth of cute. I'm bummed out a little. Really am, even with the coupons. Okay, let's get into the... What were the colors again? Purple and pink or blue and pink? This is all workout stuff. Which always comes in handy when it's cold. But nothing's grabbing me. Really? Must it mock me? <sighs> My boy is a week away from leaving me. I'm so tempted sometimes just to play dress up. What? Because every now and then I'll come across a dress that I know would fit me. <laughs> to get married. That's to get married. You want mommy to get married? No. Isn't that pretty? Now, that's what they were selling it for. It's Thrift Town selling it for. I'm curious. I can't tell, but. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. Look at that. So pretty. I was curious, but I don't see the Thrift Town tag. Okay, this is his game. No, I don't want this. I don't want this. Hmm. Do I want this? Yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> Going through the clothes, I come across something like this. I love it. Just for decoration. Sitting on my table or something. I bet it's ridiculously expensive. Well, it's $9.99. I don't like it. $10 worth. But, I don't know, kind of cute. See? Then they have little things like this. Tempting me as I look through clothes. I can't tell. $5.99. Nope. 
I'm gonna keep on looking at the clothing. Well, not much in the clothes department. Hold on, sweetie, I'm coming this way. Follow mama. Not much in the clothes department at all. For little dude, yeah. Oh my goodness. Milk glass. Miss Connie, you and milk glass. I don't know if it's real milk glass, but it's nice. So funny, I think of you guys when I'm out here. These are amazing. I see one or two of these scattered around. I would love these, but I never find more than one at a time. Stay close, Peanut. Ooh. I don't know. It looks a little ominous. I don't know about that circle. I got a spooky vibe off of that. Oh, these have been lovingly used. Y'all see that ring? That's pretty. Looky! Hmm. Her bracelets, her necklaces. Ooh. That would be pretty for perfume. Perfumes and stuff. That one too has a little bit of rust on it, but I don't have any more room for this stuff. Look at this, guys. Isn't that pretty for like a buffet? A buffet table? That is so pretty. $9.99. Pretty little teapot. Cups, 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 cups. Scan through real quick. This little guy is really tempting me because I have a thing for piggy banks. It's really cute. His bottom is missing though. And for $1.99, I don't want to struggle to find a bottom. So cute though. Look. I have one just like this on my bathroom counter right now, exactly like it. And you know what? I think I need another one. A matching set. Look at this. I don't know what it is about green glass. It's so nostalgic to me. It takes me back to my mom's kitchen when we were growing up. This is $5.99. But what would I do with it? It's so pretty. That bracelet is calling me. How much it is? I think those are cufflinks. <laughs> what are you saying? Well, that's strange. There are little gnats in there. Where'd they go? We're hiding. <laughs> little gnats. Oh my, yes. Thank you for putting those behind glass. Thank you, thank you very much. And my phone is about to die. 
so I'll have to cut this off here. We're about to try on a few things and then head out. I'll see y'all in my haul. Say see you later. See you later. Hello guys, how are y'all? I am here with the final haul. It's Sunday. I was going to wait until I went to Goodwill, but I didn't make it to Goodwill today. It's Sunday. Uh, I got sick at Walmart. Uh, one of my headaches came on and it was a bad one. It's still a little weird, uh, but my eyes are open and I can actually be in the light without getting nauseous. Um, that's new to me. Um, but um, I wanted to go ahead and show you guys what I picked up so I could put the video together and upload it. Um, I didn't get much anywhere I went. Uh, I picked up probably what you guys saw me going through. So I'm going to show you what I did pick up at Salvation Army. And I did go ahead and get the little Garfield uh, back in the day McDonald's promotion cup. Y'all remember these? What year was this? Uh, it says 1978, but I don't know if that's when McDonald's was selling them or when this strip was created. I don't know. But uh, I have another one of these, uh, another Garfield one. And every time I see these, it's nostalgic. So I pick them up. It was 99 cents, so I grabbed that. I did buy the little crawdad shot glass for my oldest. And he doesn't drink, but he likes shot glasses for some reason. And he was just too cute to pass up. I tried to straighten up his little antennae, but I'm scared that they'll break off. Well, hold on. Let's see. Okay, there we go. <laughs> so cute. That was 99 cents as well. I got the flower cross thingy. It looks black on camera, but it is blue. You guys saw it on the video. I thought that would be pretty in my living room somewhere. Little dude did get his lighthouse. It is, I didn't see that there, a light in the storm. Thomas Kincaid, my eyes twitching. Can y'all see it? I'm all messed up today. But anywho, uh, a light in the storm, Thomas Kincaid. And y'all know he likes houses, so I went ahead and grabbed it. And um, I didn't realize till we were at the cash register that it's, it takes two AAA batteries and it lights up apparently the windows and the little lighthouse, which we haven't done yet because I didn't have any AAA batteries. Excuse me. <laughs> this headache does horrible things to my stomach. Um, anywho, um, what was I saying? Yeah, it lights up. So that's going to be nice to see lit up. And the only other thing I just picked up knickknackery was the emoji little vase from my coworker. And I may not be able to part with it. Not that I have emoji, but I don't know. I just, I bought it for her, so I'll give it to her. Maybe. Anywho, that's everything I picked up at the um, Salvation Army. Uh, we went to Thrift Town, and I probably picked up everything you guys saw me pilfering through. I did get little dude uh, this sweater. Uh, it was... $4.99 for my cheap butt. That's a little expensive, but I knew I didn't have my coupon with me for November, but I knew because I shop there so often that I had to have some kind of points and so many points, so many points, um, equal to a $5 off coupon. So, and I did. So I got him the sweater. I think I only got one color tag, which might've been this. No, it was blue. I can't remember what the color tag was. I'll have to watch back in the video. But one of these was 30 cents. One of these little shirts. Uh, I think this was 30 cents. Just a little uh, t-shirt for uh, karate and playing outside. I grabbed him this pair of jeans. One of them was really, really too long. He's not quite ready for that. Uh, this one was $4.99. Just a nice wear. Nice pair of Gap jeans with not a lot of wear. We found a Spongebob pineapple, because y'all know Spongebob lives in a pineapple under the sea, and it's just this little pineapple, opens up, little door opens, and he has quite a lot, quite a few of the Spongebob play sets, so 
that was just too cute to pass up and it was only 99 cents it had flower stickers all over it apparently a little girl i'm assuming a little girl had a hold of it and decided to decorate it i pulled all those stickers off because it didn't look spongebobby with the stickers i grabbed a saving grace a real high with laughs to spare um this lady's husband commits suicide and she finds herself struggling to make ends meet so she decides to plant weed and hilarity ensues when she befriends this dude and they're trying to run from authorities i'm not even too sure but it just seemed funny an older lady growing dope and i love um craig ferguson i love craig ferguson the accent i could listen to him all day he's just awesome so i grabbed that it looked sounded funny and it was 2.99 that stings me a little because I'm used to $1.99 at Goodwill, but it's okay. And I did grab the little butterfly. So I'm going to clean it up because it's a little dirty. I'm going to clean it up and set it on my bathroom counter. And that was $1.99. And I still can't figure out how to flip the phone. Well, you guys would see it the way I see it if I had the phone flipped the other way, which gives a whole HD non-yellow color thing. But... I keep dropping y'all and then I don't know if I'm in focus and it's a big mess. So I flip it, which is why we're backwards. Oh, I did. He tried on like five pairs of jeans. Okay. See, this is how out of it I am. He did. Gra I did grab a second pair of jeans for 99 and that is everything we picked up at thrift town. Was that it? We just went to Salvation Army and thrift town. Yeah. Cause I didn't make it to, um, I didn't make it to Goodwill, but yeah, he got a nice little batch of winter clothes that I need to get washed. Um, I had a $5 off coupon. I think I ended up spending $17 maybe for all of that. Then, now here comes the part for my um, DT and 99 cent only -ers. Now, Dollar Tree, I went yesterday, 99 cent only. I made it to this morning before my headache got all weird. Uh, but... Dollar Tree I've been twice and I found fragments which I went through my list of movies and found out I already bought it. So this is going to go in my dupe box. I have a box of dupes. Things I've bought twice, sometimes even three times at Dollar Tree 99 cent only or just Walmart wherever. And uh, I think I want to do a giveaway out of my dupe box. I really want to do a giveaway. I just can't focus yet on what kind of giveaway and what I want to give away. But I got fragments again. And then First Snow. And the only reason I got First Snow was because of this dude right here. I remember him from Oz. Uh, he's an awesome actor. Um, but it sounds interesting. Um... A man's life spins out of control after a psychic tells him his days are numbered after his car breaks down in a desolate town. Uh, a fortune teller tells him he only has so much time to live that his life will soon end, but he is safe at least until the coming winter's first snow. So when the first snow comes, he's going to die. So it's a build up to his imminent death at first snow. Sounded interesting. And then I went ahead and grab these. I've been seeing these all over the place and I thought I'd give them a try. They're a dollar version of the really stupid, expensive, twisty little light bulbs. These energy savers. I've never seen them at the Dollar Tree up until maybe a week ago. And every Dollar Tree I walked into, they were there. And I went ahead and got two of them just to try them throughout the house. Most of my lamps are three ways. And these are not three ways, but I do have a few light fixtures that take just regular bulbs. So I'm going to try them out. I thought if I can save a few bucks with a buck light bulb, that'll be good. I got this Wet n Wild uh, Lipstick in Pink Ice. And the only reason I got it is because the packaging is different. It's the same exact box, but the tube itself, it looks, it's new, I guess. The colors the same, the box is the same, but the packaging is new. The, the tubing is new, so it's a pretty color anyway, so I grabbed it. I went ahead. <laughs> I have the little owls, and I've been fighting the urge to get the little acorn salt and pepper shakers just because I don't do seasonal anything. Um, but I just thought they were pretty, and I have the owls from last year, so I went ahead and got those. 
then I found, sorry guys, I'm moving my head too much and I'm getting woozy. I found these, I thought these were really cool for rainy day projects, which we have today, totally rained, it's been raining all day. These little wood shop builds and play um, wood vehicles, got a little wood helicopter and you put them together and I just thought that would be cute and fun for us to do. We'll probably do that here in a little bit. Get comfy on the bed and open these up. I got the helicopter, this little airplane, and a little sailboat. I thought these would be cute. I had bought them the metal ones before, but the pieces were so small, and at the time my nails were so long that it took me forever to get those together. I grabbed another one of the, just some snack bags, and as soon as I was at the register, I remembered I bought the ones that are measured, but I didn't feel like just throwing it or leaving it on the counter, so went ahead and bought them. I did get the AAA batteries for Little Dude's Lighthouse. That's going to be really cool if it works. I hope it works. I couldn't resist this guy. I had the fluffy one back in the day. And this little guy was sitting on the counter, and he's my favorite color in the whole wide world. And it's a pin. Couldn't resist him. He'll be sitting at my desk at work for comic relief. Apparently, I bought a water and did not drink it yesterday. That may help my situation right now. I, what else? Then, I found these again. And I love these. They're the little uh, Starlight Rose Bouquet Candles. I love these. It's a really pretty rose scent. It's not gross. Uh, it's just a really pretty rose scent. And then when I first got there, I don't know what came over me. I had a basket full of Christmas decorations. And I ended up putting them all back because... It's just more stuff to put away, more stuff to figure out where I'm going to put it. My eye's twitching. I want y'all to see my eye twitch. Do y'all see it? Y'all see that? That comes along with the um, headache, the eye twitching, headache, nausea. Yay! Anywho, I put away all the traditional Christmas stuff. But I came across these. They had gold ones and silver ones. These are so friggin' chic. They ain't nothing chic about me. Shabby chic, maybe. But they are so beautiful. I've seen stuff like this in the, the fancy schmancy uh, decorating magazines I like to look at. And they're a beautiful copy of those. So I got two of the little silver reindeers. I'm not sure where I'm going to put them because most of my decorations are gold and white, not silver and white, but I'll figure it out. I got two of them. Here's my other one. And I was, and I'm only going to unwrap it because I want to make sure that they made it home safely. All of the ones on the shelf except for these two had chips on them, but no, nope, they made it home safely. I only found two that weren't chipped all the heck. And then to go along with those, as an afterthought, I saw these, these little fake mercury glass um, little lantern doohickeys. And I thought these would look so pretty sitting next to each other on, you know, in some kind of arrangement. I got two of these. And what else? Is that all my DT? Yeah, that's all my DT. But, there, and I don't really like mercury glass. I think it looks unfinished and weird, but these were pretty. I guess because they're small, big pieces of mercury glass-esque stuff. It looks weird. It looks like, to me, it looks like they got hit by gravel and paint chipped off of it. There's my second little rose candle. But that's everything from DT and the 99 cent only. We just, I just went today. I went this morning. So I have stuff here that I usually separate that I don't show you guys. But because it's here, I'll just show you. Um, I found some Kashi Heart to Heart Honey Toasted Oat Cereal. Y'all know I'm trying to eat right. So I grabbed those. And I love, love, love Frosted Mini Meats. 
and believe it or not considering they're frosted i can't eat them with the whole diabetes thing and i saw these um gosh backwards harvest delights blueberry they had cranberry these are a buck and they're like four dollars at walmart i don't know what that's about they also had some pumpkin spice ones that i wasn't too sure about but i know that the blueberry and the cranberry are good i prefer the blueberry so i grabbed another box of those my jiffy peanut butter to go i got fuzzball more of his shiba shiba portions shiba perfect portions Oh goodness, how many did I get? I got them a whole bunch of them. And then I saw these. And I'm not big on canned menudo, canned pozole, but every now and then I'll come across a brand. Like Juanita's brand, for those of you that know what I'm talking about, menudo and pozole, it's best homemade. But uh, if you want some, the best brand that I have found that comes close to homemade once you tweak it with your radishes and onion and cilantro and stuff like that is Juanita's. Um... But I happened to be at the Nice and Only, and I saw Tia Anita's Pozolito Hominy and Pork Soup. And that's exactly what it is, for those of you guys that don't know. It's Hominy and Pork Soup, and it's delicious. Like I said, homemade is best. But I'm hoping that this doesn't taste horrible, because I have tasted some in a can. It's just really, really bad. Uh, so we'll see for a dollar what I got myself into. And then I finally broke down and went ahead and bought some replacement flowers for the vase in my big dude's bathroom. I thrifted it about two years ago. And at the time, it was in gorgeous condition. It was this vintage wax orchid uh, vase arrangement. Wax, guys. How long has it been since you guys ever saw wax flowers? Silk flowers, plastic flowers. Yeah, we still have those. But wax, I don't. I haven't seen any in a while, but they're beautiful orchids, and through the last few years, they've, they've started to dry up and crack and fade and just get really dull and ugly. The vase is still beautiful. Some of the filler is still beautiful, but the flowers themselves just look really, really gross. Uh, but I haven't wanted to throw it away because the orchids are so pretty, and I keep looking for artificial orchids. Even the Walmart ones are too expensive, but I found these little tiny ones at the Dollar Tree, and... I went ahead and grabbed four stems, so I'm finally going to replace those sad little broken wax ones in um, the bathroom. I found this for a little dude. Can y'all hear me? This is going to be a just because gift or a stocking stuffer, but I couldn't resist it. It's this little plush throw, but if you look carefully... So, that was $1.99. So I grabbed that for him as a just because gift or uh, you got a good report card gift or some, you know, something. I just couldn't resist it. It was really cute. Um, I found this, which I don't need, and I'm probably going to hold it as a gift because it's a really nice uh, little trio. Uh, it's this uh, candle holder trio. And each little votive says, one says, live as though heaven is on earth. Love always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. And laugh. Laughter is the shortest distance between two people. It was really pretty. And it was $1.99. And it doesn't feel, and it doesn't look, because they had them displayed. They don't look like they're $1.99. So I went ahead and grabbed those. And it's probably going to be a gift for Christmas. Then this I might gift to bakers or cooks in my family, or I might keep, I'm not sure, but I thought this was an awesome deal as well. $1.99 for a set of five glass bowls with lids in varying sizes. Really heavy. Uh, I love these. You can't ever have enough of this type of stuff. I can't. I, I don't think so. So $1.99. I actually had two, but I put one back. They come in different color tops. This is a blue one. It doesn't look blue. They had red and some other color. I can't remember what other color. But I just I kept the one. Look at this big mamma jamma. 99 cents. I'm paying three something, almost four bucks for this big old sucker at Walmart. 99 cents. We can always use that. Um... I grabbed, oh, I thought this would be fun. It's the Halloween Crunch, uh, Captain Crunch, but in little ghost shapes, and they turn the milk green. I thought that would be cute. They had a, 
a few left and I thought kids love Captain Crunch so we'll go ahead and try it and hopefully the green doesn't throw them off uh, my red honeysuckle nectar I got some spray of this right now I'm burning the Glade uh, wax melts in the honeysuckle nectar and it is doing wonders for my situation aromatherapy honestly works uh, I know some people when they have weird headaches like this if it is in fact migraine I am canceling that out no 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 um, I've heard that certain smells can make people sick, but I haven't Hello, had that problem, huh? Hold on. <laughs> Sorry, Grandma's here. Uh, let me finish up. What was I saying? Oh, about the smell? It hasn't bothered me yet. It actually has relaxed me and made me feel better. Uh, it's actually making me want to take a nap. But uh, the only other things that I picked up, I saw Mother of Three pick these up at her 99 cent only and I can't remember where mother of three lives but when I saw them I was like oh my gosh I want them so bad um and she's hauling them like crazy these awesome mugs and I finally found them at my 99 cent only it's this beautiful blue kind of purpley blue I can't even tell you this turquoise this green and this yellow I got two of each um I couldn't resist them they are so beautiful and they're um the brand is what got me when she said the brand they were I was like huh really these are the mulberry they're the mulberry brand oh gosh I forgot you guys are seeing it backwards they're the mulberry and for them to be at the 99 cent only, I thought that was really, really nice. There, I got one, two of each. And um, I think those are going to come in handy um, here very soon. Because the talk at church is that perhaps we can start swapping out Bible studies. That's going to be something new that we're going to try and do. We usually do it at church for those of us that can get there on Wednesdays. But we're trying to swap up some stuff for maybe Fridays. Um, and we'll swap out at houses. And if y'all are not Latinos, let me tell you something. Latinos can never get together without eating. Uh, <laughs> so... Usually the way we do it is we'll have the study and then we kind of hang around and have pan dulce, that sweet bread or coffee or sometimes we'll just have a late dinner. And I think that these are going to come in handy for when it's my turn. I'll have something to give folks their tea or hot chocolate or coffee in. But um, that's everything. That is everything I picked up. That is everything that I got a chance to get this weekend before the devil poo-pooed on my head but um um yeah i'm gonna try and put everything away and put together some of these little wood things with little dudes and i will talk to you guys my next go around thanks to you guys for watching and for my tried and trues hola guys for my new subbies hi welcome aboard uh, i'm getting a lot of you guys uh, notifying me that y'all are new subbies and i'm so glad welcome aboard my crazy train guys the more the merrier i'm glad to have y'all um and i love commenting so don't ever feel like y'all are too chatty some of y'all say oh i'm sorry my comments are so chatty Pfft, please do y'all know who y'all are talking to I, I, I have no problem with chatty it might take me a little while to comment back to you guys but i read everything and i will comment just as soon as i can even if it's just a little hugs to you and a smiley face but i love you guys for for caring about us and watching us and let me make sure little dude doesn't want to say something because y'all know he wants to hold on okay of course he wanted to say good night to you guys so and thanks for watching until my next girl and i'll talk to y'all later bye good night <laughs>